And then over here you have Rahampton Student Union, which has a lot of the representatives. And um, if you get stuck in your courses, you can approach them and they help, they sort of help out with your life around Rahampton. Bam. Okay, so, so as we said before, this is Froble Gate. This is where we came in from. It's like a side gate. Very busy road. Well, right there is the uh, female hospital. The hospital. Very nearby, only Before like... we show you how close it is. This gate. Okay, so this is the back gate. You're kind of in the way. You know, this, this is the back gate of uni. It leads to... Where does it lead? Like the lake? It's the Froebel. It Froble leads College. Froebel. Okay, so coming from the back gate, this is, what's it called? Grove House? Yeah, there's a car. Oh, there's a car. Oh, sorry. Which is, um, it's like a headquarters of sort. Of Froebel. Of Froebel. There you go. Thank you. You've got like this huge green area. If you want to sit, sit down. So coming down from the side gate, down that path, you come across, uh, you come across, what's it called? Um, Grove House, which is part of Froebel, Froebel's offices, as Jack, an alumni, an alumni student says. Yeah, this is where all the sports clubs play and whatnot. Like over here, down here, you have the gym. This is the dance hall. But they also have um, courts to play netball, volleyball, badminton, things like that. Mm. Coming from the fields in the gym down this road, you're right next to the Union, which is sort of like a, a bar that turns into a club in the evenings for the students. You can gather with your friends, you can drink. It's really popular. And then over here you have Rahampton Student Union, which has a lot of the representatives. And um, if you get stuck in your courses, you can approach them and they help, they sort of help out with your life around Rahampton. So this takes you to the front of Grove House, which is around the corner. Um, and it takes you out to this lake where you can, you know, grab a bench, have a drink, have some food, have a picnic. This is where they host a lot of events as well. Is it? Yeah, some of the too. Really? Yeah, okay. They put, they put like a stage up there. Oh, Big nice, stage. nice, nice, nice. So yeah. Summer ball happens. During summer. And then there's a winter ball as well, isn't there? So this is your sort of go-to spot for any events, really. <laughs> I don't need to speak in this part, do I? <laughs> just... just a really nice little walkway. Yes, a nice walkway. It, this, Rahampton is really popular for this walkway, actually. It's everywhere. It's everywhere. Very photographic. It is. I'm sad that I didn't get to see it in the snow, though. Okay, so coming from the student union through that corridor, the corridor that we walked through earlier, which is there, you come out onto this huge field. They host a lot of events here, a lot of sports events. Just a bit of fun and games, really. And they have um, the summer ball, which is sort of like a concert kind of thing, like isn't the it? Grand, the grand finale event of the year. The grand finale event of the year. And it comes out right in front of Grove House, which is where we walked past. The entrance that we came in is at the back over here. Yeah. Go on. Tell me about this. Uh, 
Okay, well here we're at the point where it splits into two different pathways. One takes the long way route, like the scenic route along the lake. Uh, that's down that way, and it takes you down towards some of the accommodation and the the back of the library. While nice. this way takes you towards another the the Elm Diner and some of the Elm Grove accommodations, which is where uh, Jessica actually lived and I lived Facts. for multiple years of my uni. Facts. There's also the shops down this way, isn't it? Yeah. Should we stop by there first then? If you keep going down as well, it also loops back to where we came from. Which is like the side gate. Yeah. Okay. Ooh. There's a map I can look at. <laughs> There's a map here in this case you need. Map. Yeah, this is the full campus. Yeah, we're like here. <laughs> nice. Let's do it. Let's do this. Yeah, so the, little, the little shop is down there. It's, uh, I don't know if it's open right now, but it basically encompasses this. This is like a little diner, like a cafe kind of. They, they usually have a um, all kind of range of food, and this one's like a, I think it's a vegan coffee shop. Yeah. Yeah. So it's like a vegan coffee shop, and then there's the, the chapel where you know sometimes you have lectures and stuff. It's basically a lecture hall at this point. So this is like a all accommodation. So we've walked around the entire uni now. That's the side gate that we came in from. And over here on the right, you start from scratch. Follow the path and you will find Grove House. You've got car park. Yeah, we've come full circle. Car parks here as well. We've come back full circle all the way around. So this is a photo of Rahampton, what, like yeah, a few a bit, years ago? It's a bit outdated because the library, well, there's a new library here. This I used is... to live there at one point. <laughs> <laughs> nice. And then obviously Elm Grove is absolutely missing. <laughs> because it's a new accommodation. Elm yeah. Grove is a new accommodation. And Roehampton is right next to Richmond Park. Mm -hmm. Roehampton like is quite an old uni. Yeah, it's like a 15 minute walk. 